Jumpguysdfw.net. We got about six to eight jobs on the schedule right now. It is a Tuesday. The solar eclipse was yesterday. Solar eclipse, by the way, was awesome. Really, really awesome. So we're here at the first job. And Orson got out to there it is. It's a lot of it's a lot of shit. All right, let's go first job. Hey, Mickey. How are you? Boy, I tried to call you, called you about a thousand times this morning. You were sleeping. You were really? What do you do? What do you do? Once a day, out. Thank least. you, honey. Right. Let's talk about that garage. $300. And it was tough. I, I thought that was going to be a full load for sure. Yeah. Listen, we sometimes messed up. Sometimes you got to help out. Yeah, community. somebody, you really, honestly, that's that's all it is. So her dad and her lived together for four years. Not here, but just together. She's been here six years, she told me. And her dad passed two weeks ago. And all the stuff that I was picking up was, of course, Good stuff, recyclable. Yeah, and it was her dad's. And it was her dad's, yeah. So that was pretty tough, guys. You're gonna come across these jobs all the time where someone passes away in the estate this, the estate that. And she just didn't want to think about it anymore. And, and I always get into people's business. That's my problem. Yeah, you do ask a lot of questions. And I asked when he passed away, how long ago this was all his stuff and ah. Uh, her eyes were getting watery, and this fool, I tell you, load the stuff easy. You start throwing the couch in there, man. What do you mean load it easy? You like, load it easy, we're gonna give it away to somebody. We're gonna give away her couch. I'm not, I'm gonna keep my word to that, dude. Well, you said we got eight jobs, I was trying to pack it in there tight, yeah. and then you were like, no, man, what are you doing? I'm like, we got eight more jobs. It was, it was a tough one, guys. We, we, uh, it was yeah, tough. it was. Tough. I felt bad. She, I felt she really started bad. getting her eyes started getting watery, and I started feeling bad for her. It was could have been a four hundred dollar job. Hey, listen, you know what? Three hundred bucks ain't bad either. It was fair. It was more than fair. We we're more than happy, and we got to help her out a little bit while she's going through this very very tough time. Anyway, guys, we're gonna go to our second job. We're gonna go to the second job, which is a refrigerator pickup, and it's near here somewhere. I just got to. Job number three. Oh my god, check this guy out. He goes up to the door and he has his hands behind his back like he's in trouble or something like that. Pound on the door! <sighs> Alright guys, we're here. We're removing a basketball goal. My hair is jacked up and we're ready to party. Let's do this! <laughs> Basketball goal removal. Frisco, Texas. No, McKinney. Peace. Basketball goal. We're picking up your trash right now. What is this, fourth job? Number, Number quattro. All right, Orson's just picking up the leftovers. Gonna do the best we can. Right job number cinco. It's raining right now. We just picked up this maggot infested, maggot infested refrigerator. It's awful. That's why he had me bring my truck. It on me. 
Those dogs barked at me. So I was here about six months ago and I did an eviction clean out at this house. Six months ago I did an eviction and the guy did not want me to take the fridge out. I looked inside the fridge and I told him it has maggots in it. And I said, I'll charge you an amount of money. I think it was like $1,200 plus the fridge at $1,245. He said, no, no, it's okay. We'll get rid of the fridge. Sure did, buddy. You sure did. Look, whatever, dude. Let's go to the next job. This is job number five. We're going to job number six. Peace in the Middle East. Job number six or something like that. Let's go to the next job. It's gotta be job number six, seven. I don't even know what job this is. This is six? Shit. Job number six. We're never gonna end. Okay guys, uh, we're gonna finish with this really fast. We're gonna load it up and we're going to job number seven. Seven and eight. Okay, seven and eight. So I got two left. Right, I'm going to charge about 150 for this. Not sure how much I'm going to really charge, but we'll see. Want to get more slack out of it? Well, I don't think this is going to work out. I don't think we have enough room. Yeah, we're pretty full, and it's got a propane tank. This is one of the biggest grills I've ever seen. It's a big, it's a big monster. Yeah, this though. thing, is, we underestimate the $75, dude. Yeah, yeah, we, we I gotta add a zero to the end of that number for that thing. It's gonna take up. Imagine a big, you know those big barbecue smokers when you're going down the road. You see yeah. those guys making That's barbecue, huge, bro. Yeah. That this thing makes those look yeah. like a little baby it's grill, huge, bro. bro. It's, it's gonna be huge. tough, dude. Um, I don't think I can do it. We have to go ahead and get another trailer. We Should might. we unload? Should we unload? No, nah, I don't even know if it'll fit. We might have to just pick up like a split yeah. box truck. Why don't you go out there up. and then uh, see how it is, and then I'll just. Show, show the viewers, you know. Yeah, what I mean? yeah, yeah. Yeah, so to be honest with you, I don't do jobs like this. These smokers get really, really big, but I don't think we can push it out. I'm not sure if we could push it out. Here he goes. He's gonna try it. He's not even wearing his gloves, so that's the amount of effort he's gonna put into it. All right, let's see if you can do it, man. It's heavy, right? Come on, see if you can do it. The hill, the hill, the hill, you're gonna hit the car. Oh my god. Yeah, I think it's dangerous. Job number seven. All right, guys, we just finished job number seven? Seven and eight. Seven? Seven, man. Seven, or was that eight? I'm not sure which, it doesn't matter which number it is. Cause I'll look at the video and then I'll just put it out there, okay? Seven, because then we started my truck with five, yeah. which was the fridge. Uh -huh. Wait, but there's two fridges in here. Six. Maybe this Five, is eight. Five, six. The mattresses were seven. This is eight. This is eight? Yeah, because in your truck we did four. One, two, three, four. Yeah, that's right. And then we started with mine, which was five, which was a fridge, but there's two fridges here, so that means we did the two fridges. So that's fridge. Three. We started with an empty trailer. Yeah. We started at five. So the first one was, let's go to the apartments. Five, right? Yeah. The fridge, six. The other fridge, seven. This job, eight. Oh my gosh, we are on job nine, aren't we? Yep, we're going to job nine. Oh my gosh, guys, we messed up. We're going to job number nine right now. So we just hit... Boy, this is the last job on schedule. The last job on the schedule. And we switched cars. So we went back to the headquarters. We emptied out the two refrigerators, the frame to the bed, and also the propane tank and the barbecue grill. And we emptied that out. Now, Orson should be here in a second. I brought my car, my little small car, which in the next few days shouldn't be here. But I came to the last job and got here before Orson did. He should be here in about five minutes. He said he's running a little behind. Get to stop and get some fuel, but check it out. That is the last job of the day, right there. That's the last job. So what would you charge for something like this? Yeah. What would you charge? Holy cow, that's a lot of stuff, man. Uh -huh. A lot of big stuff. Easily fill up a trailer. Easily fill up a trailer. So what is your number? This, honestly, is the ninth. Numero nueve. Nine jobs today that I've completed. Nine jobs with Orson that we've done. It's slow time in junk removal. It is slow. Oh, look. 
didn't even see that frame that we got to recycle. Look at that. There is a frame right there that needs to be recycled. Crazy, huh? People just illegally dump wherever they want to. They don't. All right, guys, so we're going to get done with this in a minute, and then I'll get back to you. Probably do a time lapse, and we'll go over all the jobs. Bye-bye. <laughs> Nine jobs on the schedule today. Nine, count them, nine jobs. All of them done with my boy Orson. Orson! Number one, the first job that we did today was in my truck. Yes, sir, yeah, we picked up uh, a For Mickey. Of, for Mickey, a garage cleanup. Garage cleanup, right, very sad cleanup. garage cleanup. That was 300 bucks. Uh, the next job that we did was in Frisco. It was a refrigerator. Yeah. That was $45. And the next job was in McKinney. A basketball hoop. A basketball hoop. No, in McKinney we did another fridge, and then we did. Oh, that's field. true. Yeah, okay. we did do two. So we did another fridge in McKinney for forty-five, and then a basketball for forty. For seventy-five. Right? I don't know. No, no, that was seventy-five. Seventy-five bucks, and then uh, we had a full trailer, and that was four jobs. So then we ended up going back to the headquarters. We switched vehicles and went and did our fifth job, and the fifth job was another refrigerator. Another refrigerator yeah. for forty-five. Yeah. For 45. And then we did the mattresses. For 200. And then we did a barbecue grill. Oh, the, wait, wait, what mattresses? The mattress. Yeah, we did mat a mattress and a box room from that apartment. 115. Ah, oh, 115. 15. That was eight. No, that was seven. Seven. And then eight was. The barbecue grill and the concrete. That was $200. 200. And then. The up. 300 bucks right here. And that's our day, man. That's we made we, we a little over a thousand bucks. Didn't we? Nice, yeah, good, good mother there. Be narrow. Be narrow. Hi guys, we're out of here. Thanks for coming. Peace out.